In today's video, you're gonna learn how to create 30 days or one month's worth of Instagram content in just one day. Now, I wanna thank everyone who has made this video go viral recently. I appreciate all your support. You guys are the best. Now, if you're trying to create consistent content on Instagram, you know that it can be tough and you may have seen big accounts churning out posts every day and you're like, what the f It can be demoralizing, right? Because maybe you have a full-time job or you're just trying to grow this social presence online and you've only got a little bit of time to do it in. So how the hell are you going to compete with that? Well, the outlook is sunny. You see, there is a smart way to do this, which smaller to medium-sized accounts are doing and creating consistent content in less time. And this is more important than ever because Instagram are only making it harder to grow on their platform organically. I'm gonna share with you three different steps that you can create consistent content on Instagram and it's actually gonna be really simple to do. The first thing you need to do is you need to shoot your month's content in one day. You are hearing me correctly. This is something which you can actually quite easily do as long as you plan ahead. Now, I'm very aware of how uninspiring the word plan is, and a lot of you watching this might be thinking, I hate planning, but you need to really start to flirt and fall in love with planning, because the truth is, if you're not planning, you're going to fail. And the best way to plan your content is to get inspiration. A great place to get inspiration, and one that I use, is Pinterest. Using Pinterest is simple. Let's say you're a portrait photographer and you want to get ideas. Just type in portrait photography on Pinterest search and up will pop a load of pictures providing you with inspiration for your content. Now you collect that content so that you can refer to this at a later date and you'll need to save it. To do this, you can easily create a board and pin it and save it there so that you can check this out whenever you need to. Once you've got the inspiration you need, it's time for step two, and that's to turn this inspiration into a final plan that you can carry out on the day. The questions you'll need to answer to create this plan are how much content am I going to create? And you also need to ask the question, how many times a week will you be posting to Instagram? So if you're planning on uploading four times a week, you're gonna need 16 photos on the day that you shoot. Next question is where is the shoot taking place? You need to know your location and a tip is to visit the location beforehand. A lot of people don't do this. But if you do this, you'll know exactly where the places are which is gonna work for your content that you're gonna be creating. The third question is what do you need to take? This is essential to plan before you go. Just imagine traveling to the perfect location, which is like an hour plus drive away, and you realize you forgot to pack your camera. If you're creating fresh content for each week of the month, it's going to need to look really brand new. And that means you won't want to be wearing the same clothes for every photo you're taking. It's gonna look a bit sus. So a few changes on the clothes front will be essential to ensure that your content looks fresh and new. Otherwise, if you're shooting a model, ensure that she has changes of clothes that she brings with her. If you're shooting the location itself, let's say you're a landscape photographer, then you will need to maybe visit a few locations. Two locations that are very near proximity to each other, and then you can shoot big to small, the grand epic open landscape, and the smaller details in the landscape itself like a lone tree, or the way the light hits the landscape. Okay, so you now know your final plan, which I highly recommend you print out, as you'll need a few physical copies to keep. You're now ready for shoot day and to create your content for the month. This strategy will work for almost everyone that applies it. Today's bonus tip is really important. If you're someone who struggles to create your content alone and you need help from someone like a photographer, then there are actually photographers you can hire for this exact kind of thing. 
But if you don't have the money to pay for a photographer, don't worry. There are photographers willing to do this free and are looking for more experience to build a portfolio. A good idea would to be partnering up with them where you can mutually help each other out. There are sites like Purpleport, StarNow, which you can join free and the photographers will be willing to do this. These photographers will also do the editing too, which is going to save you a ton of time. Otherwise, if you don't like the idea of this, you can always ask a family member or friend to help you out to start with until you feel more comfortable with the idea of working alongside a photographer. In this video, you have learned how to create consistent content for Instagram in just one day. The next question you'll need to answer is how to schedule that content on Instagram and save yourself even more time. To learn how to do this, hit subscribe and hit the notification bell because I will be releasing part two in a few days time. Thanks for watching today's video guys and whatever you do for the rest of the day, make sure it's a good one and I'll see you in the next video.